Hi, my name is Matt Taylor, and I'm the lead engineer of the Yahoo Mojito project. Uh, what Mojito is, is it's a web application framework, and it's written entirely in JavaScript. Uh, what this enables you to do is write your web components in JavaScript so they can run on the server, but what makes Mojito special is, because it's all JavaScript, it can deploy those components to the client and have a second runtime of Mojito on the client where your web components run. Now, Manhattan is a cloud-based Mojito hosted environment. So we're going to go through creating an app and we're going to deploy one to the cloud using Yahoo's Manhattan project. Firstly, we'll just uh, use the Mojito command line, which um, all I've done at this point is checked out the Mojito source code and installed it as a Node.js package. Uh, so now I have Mojito as a command line tool. I can say Mojito start and that will start up the web server so what we have here is uh, a Mojito app that just displays several different news feeds on the main page. And each one of these I can click into and scroll through news feeds uh, with my mouse with a swiping action. Another nice thing about Mojito apps is it makes it easy for you to provide progressive enhancement for your applications. So for example, if I go into my preferences, turn JavaScript off, I can refresh any one of these pages. And before, you noticed I was swiping back and forth, which is a rich JavaScript interaction provided on the client. But if JavaScript is disabled, that swiping goes away. But I still have these navigation buttons on the right and the left bottom sides of the screen. Because I wrote my markup in a way that uh, was applicable even without JavaScript, everything just works. The JavaScript provides a layer on top of that to augment the base functionality of the page. So I've showed you a deployment of a Mojito application locally on my laptop, and now I'm going to show you deploying the same application without changing a line of code or a line of configuration out to our cloud hosting environment, Manhattan. So I have a command, GHH, which is my deployment command. I give it an application key, my username and password for the cloud hosting environment. And now what Mojito is doing is it's bundling up this whole application, zipping it up, and pushing it out to the Manhattan hosting environment. Manhattan is going to take this application and start it up on one of its nodes and give us back a URL that we can go start that, run that application from. OK, so it just gave me a URL. Once I click on it, I go back to this application, that the, the URL that the, uh, the Grasshopper script gave me, and I have this same app that I was just running locally on my laptop is now running out on the cloud hosting environment. Everything still works exactly the same way. I haven't touched a line of configuration or a line of code. This application just works. So we've got two deployments now, easily just with uh, scripts from the command line. So now what I'm going to show you is another way to deploy Mojito applications. Now, again, without touching any configuration or lines of code, I've got a command that I can say mojito create project Xcode. And I've just created an Xcode shell for an iOS project that contains this web application as its one view. I can open it in Xcode. And this project is ready to go. I don't have to touch anything in Xcode. All I have to do is click this Run button deploy to my iOS device, and this application runs straight from the mobile device. All of the files have been transferred to this mobile device, and this is running completely off of the mobile device without a server. So to recap, we've just taken the same Mojito application, and without changing any configuration or code, we've run it locally on my laptop, We've uh, used Grasshopper to deploy it out to the cloud to Manhattan. And we've also deployed it from my laptop to a mobile device. And this is just one example of a mobile device that we can deploy Mojito applications to. So now we're seeing it running in three different places, all within a matter of minutes.